Hi, I'm Steven, also known as Powerful SL on YouTube. I have a YouTube channel with almost 60 subscribers where I do mostly game related things like Mario and, and Cuphead. This isn't Cuphead. I thought this was Cuphead. <laughs> I'm not quite big enough to make money off of it quite yet, but with enough experimenting and hard work, I'll get there eventually. Now some of you may be thinking, wow, this guy has a voice? I thought this guy was mute or something. And to that I say, yes, I do have a voice. Yes, I do use it quite a bit, as you can clearly see here. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't even be doing YouTube in the first place. But anyway, I'm here to tell you about what I do as the minuscule YouTuber I am. I'll be showing you where I do all my recording, the process of editing that I usually do to make magic happen, and basically anything else that's required in this presentation. With that being said, let's just jump into this. This is why I like to do all of my work. I got a nice, beefy computer, a big monitor. Just kidding, I actually do almost everything on this piece of junk right here. Hey, baby. Yeah. This thing's pretty old, and it can be pretty slow. Half the ports on this thing don't even work anymore, but at this point, I have to work with what I can get. I also have this microphone right here that I'm using at this current moment. Don't ask me what kind it is because I don't have the slightest clue. Now for my setup, it's less like this and a bit more like this. I mean, it's not much, but it's comfortable to say the least. Also, I get this nice view of my display of video game merchandise that I've collected over there. This is my life now, and I'm not ashamed of it. As for my process of video making, I first start off by recording footage of a game, of course. It's usually around an hour of footage, which is quite a bit, I know, but I'll explain why soon about why I record so much. In this video, I'll be using the game Turbo Dismount as an example, because it just so happens to be the next game I wanted to do a video on. Once I have all of my footage, I'll go into my editing software, which is usually Adobe Premiere, and get to work on the longest part of the process, which is, of course, editing. Now, the reason I do about an hour of footage is because I usually take that footage and chop it up into smaller pieces to leave out any boring parts for creating more of an entertaining experience. Occasionally, I'll throw in a neat little edit to add to the charm of the video. Sometimes it'll be a sound effect. Oh no. No. What? Some images or GIFs. Is that from Star Trek? <laughs> some sort of zoom. You've disappointed me, my friend. The possibilities are practically endless. Once all of that is out of the way, I'll export it from the software, which takes about 30 minutes to an hour. Then it's ready for uploading. I'll head off to YouTube to upload my video and modify how I want it to be seen. I'll add a nice description, an eye-catching title and thumbnail, add some tags so it'll be found easier, and then wait for it to finish uploading. Once it's done, I click publish, and now it's out there for the whole world to see. If you'd like to see the finished product, just go check it out on my YouTube channel called PowerfulSL, as previously mentioned. Am I advertising my channel on a school project? Yes. Yes, I am. Now you know the process of making a video, even though those of you that are probably interested already have a YouTube channel. And if not, you probably already know the process anyway. It's kind of obvious. You know who you are. Well, this is Powerful Cell, signing off. Goodbye.